What's up, YouTube? Draw somebody by town. So I did an unboxing video, and what do you know? My Elgato completely messed up on me. There was just no way that anybody could watch it. It was just horrible, horrible video recording. I mean, it was just so bad. Which really upset me because I got some good weapons. I got the new sniper rifle as you see here. And then I got some nunchucks and some other things. But when I first pulled this sniper rifle out and started using it, I had no idea how to use it. Like, I was, I was doing really bad with it. Worse than I'm actually doing now. And I'm on a bad connection right here. For some reason, the lobbies in Black Ops 3 have just been absolutely horrible for me. I don't know if they've been like that for everybody else. But a lot of the lobbies that I've been in... Like, you see, I shot him, but it didn't register that I shot him till like, a second later. And, that, and you know, that's just not how it should be. So, so, so you can tell that there's some lag and some latency there. There's a lot of issues like that. Now, let's... Talking about the sniper rifle that I'm using. Now, from what I hear, it's compared to the DSR-50 and Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Now, I don't see that connection at all. And the reason I say that is because I remember the DSR-50 from Black Ops 2 when it very first came out. It, it, it was on point. You hit somebody, they died. It was just an overall well well made sniper rifle now what happened to the DSR 50 is it went through so many changes that it just it just became a a non sought for sniper rifle not a lot of people started using it after time they started using the ballista me included and what's so cool about the ballista is it was actually a it is a challenging weapon to use and that's that's where I come in with this weapon here yes this weapon is a challenge to use it is it's it's a it's, it's not something that you you know not everybody will just be able to pick up and automatically use because first off it starts off with just an iron sight and then you've got to unlock the sights for it. And they don't actually have a scope for it. So. So you can see where I'm coming from there. Anyways. Once I got used to using this sniper rifle. I started to notice that it is fun. It is fun to use. You will run into some situations where you're going to get hit markers and you shouldn't but you know that's that's just all part of the game that's that's just how things are done I mean let's face it hit markers are something that we all hate we don't like hit markers nobody likes hit markers but you're not gonna go and play hardcore because of it are you no no you're not every so often I like to play hardcore but that's just me you know, when I want to relax, I want to, I want to hang out. But you always have those people that go to hardcore to act like they're hardcore because it's so easy to kill people, and then they end up thinking that they're really good at the game. <laughs> it's funny. It's 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 funny to see people play like that and hardcore to act like they're beasts at the game when they're playing at basically 30% health. But it's all good. It's all good fun. I will start doing a live stream with this weapon here. Y'all will for sure see it coming to my channel pretty soon. I just wanted to go ahead and get this uploaded before I actually do that. 
I've got another 1v1 coming up for y'all, so hopefully y'all enjoy that. A lot of you seem to enjoy those 1v1s. I'm asked quite often to do more 1v1s, and I'm trying to put those out there as much as I can for y'all. But um, just, just do understand, I do upload those 1v1s, rather. I win or lose. It doesn't matter. And someone had made a comment about that, why I upload the 1v1s that I lost. You know, I I don't want to hide anything, and I've, I've been over this already. And also, that person that I 1v1, they deserved the video. They deserved to be to be on my channel. I mean, they, you know, they beat me fair and square. And then I'll upload our game. And I even if I didn't upload it, some people, you know, they're they're so so competitive and they want to beat me so bad that they do beat me, and if I was not to upload it, they would come to my channel and ask why the video of our game was not uploaded. Now, that being said, not every video gets uploaded. And pay close attention to this. Pay very close attention to what I'm about to tell you. Not every video gets uploaded. Rather, I win or lose. Not all of it gets uploaded. Sometimes my Elgato messes up. Sometimes I'm not recording. So if we 1v1 and it doesn't get uploaded, rather I won the game or lost, just understand that that's what happens. Sometimes my Elgato screws up and just doesn't work. I don't know why, but it does it. But this is pretty much the end of the game. I hope you all enjoy. Thanks for all the attention to my channel. Thanks for all the subscribers. Thanks for the likes, the comments. Please keep those likes and comments rolling in. I love replying to y'all in the comment section. Baytown Cowboy 85 over and out.